So I've decided to watch Westworld from the very beginning for the culture. And this show first came out in 2016. So I don't know if you guys have been watching this show since the very beginning, but there's a good chance that even if you have, you haven't seen these first season episodes in so many years. I mean, it's been about six years. And there's so many things you might have missed. Things that are incredibly relevant to the present season. When the pilot opens up, we're sort of introduced to our protagonist, Dolores. And now Dolores Abernathy is the oldest host in a theme park called Westworld. We learn from some dialogue cues that Westworld has been around for about 30 years and that Dolores is the oldest host in the park. Hosts in the world of Westworld are animatronic AI humanoid-like beings that rely on a complex system of mathematical equations and computer technology interface to appear to human guest visitors as humans, but they are actually robots. And while the AI have in-programmed um, storylines so that they interact and interface with one another as if they're characters in a book or a TV show, which is mainly for the amusement of the uber wealthy visitors to this park, the robots themselves do not know that they are a part of this, you know, grand scheme. One of the big themes of Westworld is have you ever questioned the nature of your reality, thinking about is the life that we are living a simulation? And oftentimes the show makes the sort of, um, you know, observation that how interesting would it be to put a simulation within a simulation, which is a callback to us watching Westworld, because Westworld in and of itself, the television show, is a simulation of all of these actors and storylines. And we, you know, could be argued as the, the theme park guests who are coming to watch these people undergo savagery in the name of entertainment. It's a very meta show if you think about it. Now, when we first meet Dolores, um, her facial expressions are not how they are here. Here's a little uh, from later on in the season. She's often depicted as this sort of placid, smiling, just very like happy-go-lucky, grateful, you know, prairie girl. And that's very intentional because the way that they like promote these hosts is with a degree of innocence. Dolores every day wakes up and walks out of her house and says hello to her very unassuming, sort of stereotypically paternal father, Peter. And they sort of have this, you know, idyllic exchange of, make sure you're home before dark, dear. Of course, father, you know that I will be. That is until in the pilot, Peter finds something when he's out in the field. Peter, who is also unaware that he is a host in this theme park, finds a photograph of an, a guest, you know, standing in New York City and it begins to make his world unravel. 